Yeah, and that uh, ticketing at the church that was caught on video, put on Facebook, and that resulted in stirring up a lot of frustrations that already existed around the parking authority since they changed in December to 24-7 parking enforcement. Well, we talked to the chairman of the parking authority, and he says there could be changes coming up. Community members looking for free food for their families at a church distribution event Saturday left with a $35 ticket from the parking authority. For some people, $35 is a huge difference. Pastor Alejandro Escamilla runs the Fuente de Vida church event and recorded this video of the incident. He tells me they've been holding these food events since 2018 and they've never had an issue before. I know there's a lot of traffic, but we're doing fast. And uh, we never have issues. We never have problems. The chairman for the parking authority says they didn't know this was a distribution event. They were responding to a complaint from a neighbor. As we get a call for complaint because streets are blocked. Mm -hmm. So, and we don't have notice of like these events. So we're going to remain in the crosshairs. Once they figured out what was going on, they changed the nine tickets to warnings. But the church video of the interaction stirred up frustration already brewing towards the parking authority, which switched to 24-7 parking enforcement late last year, affecting locals and businesses. A person comes to get an order of tacos and then he's parking right there just to pick up an order and comes out of there with another $100 ticket for, for them to pay. The mayor calling on the parking authority board to make changes. I want to see an improvement in the way that they serve the residents. So particularly in exercising discretion in a city where the parking need is great. Meanwhile, the chairman tells me they're looking at potentially rolling back enforcement. They're also looking to invest in more training to prevent issues like the church event and are even offering them help to find another space. Pastor Escamilla willing to work with whoever to help his community out. Everybody has to work for the community. That's, that's parking authority even has to work with the community. That's a common sense for me. And we do know that there's a parking authority board meeting right here in Allentown. That's going to happen tomorrow where they're going to be discussing about potentially rolling back some of that enforcement as well as several other issues. I'll send it back to you. I'm Miguel Martinez-Valle, NBC10 News.